Hi there. As part of today's presentation, I'm going to demonstrate the proposed thin client solution for our customer. Before I start, I want to run these devices past you, which are typically used in a VDI deployment. We have here a wise ThinOS thin client, uh, which is currently an Atos CTO accepted solution. You may be quite familiar with these as they have been around for many years. However, these are not cheap and they range from 130 to 300 pounds depending on device and spec. Secondly, another potential thin client solution. However, this is a small form factor PC which can be used as a repurposed thin client. Various thin client management software exist currently on the market for this kind of solution. Um, obviously, all the existing PCs can be repurposed for this uh, for VDI. Um, however, performance, power, and so on will be a factor to consider. Thirdly, a high-end uh, thin client, um, which runs Windows embedded. These are thin clients are, are the best for providing support for high-end graphics, larger scope of peripheral support, and, and many more um, features because they are pretty much run Windows. Um, and all the providers, Citrix, VMware, and all those support, have better support for um, you know, additional features uh, for, your, for the video, for typical VDI environment. Um, and then obviously what we're proposing is this, it's uh, the Raspberry Pi. So as you all know, um, there's a well-known mini PC which was originally developed um, to teach people how to write code. And uh, in the last few years, many more development on these devices led to some really cool use cases and VDI um, is one of them. So um, here's a typical case for it. As you can see, it fits inside the case. Um, our customer for this, 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 this environment we are looking at high security um, didn't want this plain case. They would wanted a secure case to protect the SD card and, and other bits, which is what we sourced. So we have sourced a uh, high end device, a high secure device, um, which you can secure the. SD card, you can also secure the cabling, um, you know, and you have to pretty much dismantle the whole device um, in the office to get access to um, the SD card. There's also nothing on the SD card anyway, apart from uh, Raspbian, which is a Linux based operating system. So, uh, yeah, back to the demo. Right, we're back. Um, all I've done is connected up the Raspberry Pi as a naked device, no cover attached for the purpose of the demo, uh, just the Ethernet cable and I'm actually pulling the power from another computer in uh, the office, um, connected to a wireless keyboard and mouse, uh, like over here, and a monitor. All I've done is booted up the device, um, it's automatically can opening in Citrix receiver, so I'm going to just log in my credentials and uh, uh, using a Windows 7 machine um, for the purpose of this demo big box standard box and uh, I'll just for the purpose open WordPad and it is pretty responsive this machine is actually living in another location at the moment so it's all remote working as it is right there right here um, and then also I've just got a link to a YouTube movie clip um, just to prove it's typically working and there you go um, that's just a, a slight demo of the of the uh, video I think client um, using Citrix in this case. We can also configure this system to work with many other clients. Um, so for instance, VMware View could be one. This is all centrally, can all be centrally configured and managed if required. Okay, 
Thank you very much.